My name is Fabulous Frank, manager of champions here in South Florida, here in Division I Pro Wrestling. The home one time of one Tommy Vandal. And Tommy, you started your career here, then you went up to North Carolina and became a champion right away. So now there you are with a big head, you're a big fish in a little pond. But now you think you're somebody. So now you want to come back down here, you want to jump in the ocean. And you may be a big fish, but this is the great white. This is the world's largest athlete maximum capacity. That's right, I'm 650 pounds of the biggest, baddest, and best there is in this business. Tommy Vandal, you forget, we broke into this business together. We trained side by side. We've had the same manager at different right. times. We traveled this entire state on road trips. And we even faced against each other in the ring a few times. Now, Frank, when he left his state, what happened to Tommy Vandal? What happened to Tommy Vandal? He got soft. That's right. You got soft. You lost that fire and desire that you once had when you were in this state. When Frank was managing you, you were one of the best right. wrestlers there were. You were part of the Vandals, one of the greatest tag teams in this state. You had the best manager in this business managing you. What happened? You left this state. You went to North Carolina. You became soft. You ain't got what it takes someone to be in this business. I question your heart and desire, and I question why people still use you. Now, July 21st, Fabulous Frank and I, we're challenging you. We're going to give you a chance to become a man once again. We'll give you a chance to come back to where it all began, right? Right here in Florida where your career started on July 21st, it just may end. Davey P.A.L., Division One Pro Wrestling, Tommy Vandal, Fabulous Frank and I, we challenge you for your WCEW Extreme title. We're going to give you the chance that nobody else in this business will give you. We're going to give you a chance, number one, to face the world's largest athlete. Right here. We're going to give you a chance to face the best manager managing the world's largest athlete. And we'll give you a chance to get your set of balls back, <laughs> to become a man. Uh, Frank, you remember the days when you used to manage Tommy and Ricky? Absolutely. They were the best. They were the most feared tag team in this state. Now he's up there in a bunch of inbred hicks and chewing tobacco, whatever it is they do up there, and you're soft, you're weak, you've lost your manhood up there. So on July 21st, why don't you come and try to get it back? The funny thing is, you moved to North Carolina, your brother Ricky, I don't know where the hell he is. He's in a homeless shelter somewhere. The best vandal right now resides in this state, Johnny Vandal. The little runt? Please. The little runt is the best of the vandals, that's a shame. That if is. you could say Johnny Vandal is the best of the vandals, you guys need to get out of this business now. But again... July 21st, we want you to bring your title back to the state of Florida. We want you to come back and start fishing in this ocean. Because you've been fishing in a pond for the last few years. No more. Frank, I want you to finish this. July 21st, Tommy Vandal, you, against the world's largest athlete, maximum capacity, falls count anywhere. Oh, yeah. Falls count anywhere? Oh, yeah. That means I can pin it by the concession stand, grab a hot dog, and go oh, celebrate? Yeah. <laughs> that sounds good to me, baby. Tommy, if you've got the guts, you'll be there July 21st and bring that belt with you because you're not going home with it. Falls count anywhere? Baby, it's over. I'll see you. Or maybe I won't. But I'm going to hope and pray that you got an ounce of balls and inner fortitude left. July 21st. Frank, this interview is done. Kill that camera.